puffed, man. Why did I do that as an intro sequence? But you know, I am just, I was just very excited and happy to be back because it's been almost two years since I have been away from YouTube. That's right, two goddamn years. But this video is to officially announce that I am back after literally so long it has been so long i'm just glad i'm here i'm glad i'm talking to the, the goddamn camera i'm seeing my face on the webcam i'm recording audio I, i'm doing all this and i'm just glad i'm just i'm just here because uh the past two years was i just spat off for god's sake uh but yeah this video is probably a mess right now because i i've this is the first video back so i'm still trying to get used to like everything again but it's just i just i'm just glad to be back Obviously, the past two years was very hard to deal with and I'm just glad I've I've come out of that and I'm in this position right now to be able to do all this. So I feel I feel proud of myself and strong and just 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 all sorts of like positive emotions in my heart kind of thing. Like that's how I feel right now. But basically, uh, just to update you all about like where I where I was the past two years, because I literally didn't upload uh, at all, like since since like what 2020? Which is yeah, that's like two years. But just to give like a just a gist of what happened, just a brief, brief gist, I had some health issues that started back in 2020 and it was caused by this doctor who actually did this to me this doctor gave me an oral drug that i never needed i never needed it at all i never needed this drug at all like i i literally came into the doctors for such a minor issue like just a skin irritation caused by using this this product of amazon that i shouldn't have bought but i, I went to the doctors and uh i was thinking she'd give me some cream just for the irritation but she ended up giving me this really powerful oral drug that um that had disastrous consequences for me and my body and it just um it just messed up everything in my body like i had so many scary symptoms and like uh things going on inside that wasn't normal and it wasn't just one thing i had it was like so many things like multiple things happening at once that it became so much to like too much to deal with and obviously when I went to the second doctor to like uh, to talk more about it like um the second doctor was confused why the first doctor even gave me this drug in the first place and I already knew it was a mistake because I had all these this weird crazy ass symptoms um that was just really scary really horrible to go through um I don't want to go through that again but it was just it was just it wasn't nice like it was a horrible experience and it like you know it just made me temporarily distrust certain doctors but obviously there are, there are some doctors who are good it's just there are also some doctors who will give you medicines that you don't need and they those medicines have very powerful side effects and i think what made it worse was i was having all these symptoms and at the time uh like first some doctors not the nice doctor because he didn't specialize in what i was going through but some other doctors is like they i had all these symptoms but they were still like they did like one little test and they were like oh no nothing, nothing wrong with you um it's probably normal the test is never wrong and stuff but i'm still having all these crazy ass symptoms that is not normal it's scary and you know i just wasn't living normally at all and then it wasn't until like my symptoms got worse because the doctors first didn't do anything at all that um then i finally realized what it was when it got to the really bad stage and then the doctors finally realized what it was as well and we both realized it was the same thing so obviously i knew first anyway but then the doctors were like yeah it is, it's this they confirmed it so then a couple of months later i finally took like the uh the right medicine for it finally after like what like nearly a year of just struggling on my own um and that was by august like 2020 um but that medicine did have some side effects just minor side effects nothing like nothing big it's just very minor even babies get it so it's 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 not really that bad but it's just i had some side effects that i was dealing with and i think also just the mental trauma of everything going through all that quite a few side effects I had to go through before it finally started to get better and my body starts to heal on its own and thing 
but it just took some time so that's why i was away for a while because i was just struggling to just just deal with everything but i just had to heal as well which was important but it's just i wasn't sure what was happening was i getting better was i not getting better and i was just in that state of uncertainty oh ah! but i was just in that state of uncertainty about what was going on but then obviously i realized it was getting better um everything was going fine and i still have one minor side effect left but compared to 2020 so in 2022 right now it's like 80 percent better now um i say 75 percent 80 percent better um and apparently um it will get better on its own within a few years so it's been two years so far it's already like 75 percent better anyway but it might be a few more years until it until it's completely healed up but thankfully like my body's healing it on its own so hopefully within a few years it should be gone but it's, it's a really minor side effect babies get it goo goo gaga so i am fine so luckily i got the the great job of just letting my body do its thing i don't have to do anything i don't take any meds for it it's just your body heals everything on its own so yeah um that last the last minor side effect is like 75 percent better now anyway compared to two years ago but it's better and within a few years maybe i don't know maybe next year or the year after or two more years three more years i don't know but that will be fully gone but it's already healing on its own so it's almost gone now anyway but it's just yeah it's just a really long process but yeah that that was just um my struggle my physical struggle my mental struggle but yeah at the moment i'm just i'm just glad to be i'm just glad to be doing this now i'm glad to be just you know getting my immune system everything recovering again i have been eating so healthily i haven't had a donut or a, a chocolate cake or anything i've just been eating like super like clean and healthy and wholesome really healthily just getting my immune system and my gut like just functioning to a high a high efficiency efficacy is that a word i don't know but um actually yeah it is a word but yeah so i've just been doing that just letting my body heal on its own get to the best it can be uh and even the bestest of them all like, I'm, I'm just doing all that now but yeah that's basically what was going on in me um I'm still pretty like angry about what happened you know like I, I didn't deserve that to happen and I didn't deserve a, a doctor doing this to me but you know it just sometimes stupid things happen and it sucks really bad um but even though I, I didn't even know if I was even gonna be better or not like you know but luckily things did get better but at the time I was like is this gonna get better am I just gonna be stuck like this forever but it luckily time and I think also just, I don't know, because I feel like I also kind of played a part in it. Like, I, ha I had to make sure I got help as well. Otherwise, if, if I didn't get that help, if, if I didn't keep pushing, I probably would have maybe still struggled the same. But it, it took it took time. I, I conquered through it and I am ready to just, just literally just do everything I want to do now but yeah I'm glad that I'm just I'm just here I'm, I'm just doing this I'm doing what I want to do now and I just have that mindset it's just stronger my body feels stronger and I'm just you know I'm just here to just just, just own it okay uh but yeah that's basically just the gist of it again this is my first video back so sorry if everything is just I just I'm getting used to this talking again and like in front of everything but yeah but I'm just glad to be back um, you know, I've got a lot of scary, scary ass games that I'm literally, I can't wait to record and I'm literally going to record something right after this video as well. I hope you guys, I hope you guys are all good as well. I just want to say everyone, you know, they, they sent me comments and messages as well. Uh, like while I was like, uh, you know, isolating myself with my goddamn, you know, hell. Uh, but I just want to say thank you guys for everyone who, you know, reached out to me during that time. And they were, you know, like asking how I was, where I was, and even leaving comments under videos as well. Sorry, I haven't literally replied to anyone. I, I was just, I was just going through so much, man. My head was all over the place at the time. And my, and my body. And my body. But, you know, it's just, I'm just, thank you for everyone just reaching out and just still keeping in touch. Even though I've literally disappeared. I have flaked on everyone i'm just out but it's just you know thank you guys for everyone just like being there like i appreciate it i really didn't want to leave but it was just one of those situations where like 
it was just it became too much like not something i could even handle on my own and stuff but i just want to say thank you guys for just being there i appreciate you guys i appreciate you but yeah be prepared for some scary ass games i got scary ass games coming up on the on the channel um i think the next game i'm planning to record is house of ashes that's right guys the dark pictures the, ne the 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 third chapter is coming out i am literally planning to record it right after this as well nothing jinxes it but yeah i know man and madan is on the channel little hope i think that time i was away from youtube i ended up playing little hope on my own anyway but like not like straight away after it released because i was thinking okay maybe i'm just gonna like um like wait till it like wait till i come back on youtube or something and then like play it but then um 10 months passed and obviously i was still away from youtube for like literally what feels like years but i was like screw it i'm gonna play little hope like i i, I, need, I need to play something i'm i, I want to play little hope so i played little hope but house of ashes i have played the demo for it because at the time i was kind of broke and i was like i want to play house of ashes but i don't want to pay like 24 pounds for it just yeah so i'm gonna play the demo and then maybe i'll i'll just play it on my own but then i played the demo the first like 20 minutes of the game but um by that time i was like okay yeah i'm coming back to youtube so i haven't played the full game yet i've only played the demo for house of ashes but not the full game so i'm gonna get started on that as the next game get editing I've got to edit, oh my god. Uh, but yeah, um, I will definitely get those videos up. Uh, like I said, I hope you guys are all good. Again, I'm sorry for just being away for so long and just, you know, just everything going on. But yeah, but I'm glad to be back. I can't wait to make more videos. We've got a lot of horror games like coming out this year. Like there's, uh, obviously we've got the next Dark Pictures Anthology, The Devil In Me, and um, we've got the Callisto Protocol. Is it close to purple, I think? Um, and then we got the like some DLCs. Like, we got loads of stuff coming out as well this year. So I'm excited to finally get started on it. But we've got a lot of horror coming out. It's going to be Halloween soon. So yeah, spooky, spooky season is back, baby. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to go get busy on, on this video. Let's get on this. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one this time i am back i'll see you guys in the next one next time stay safe stay good stay well stay healthy stay blessed you know what i mean and yeah i'll see you all in the next one next time wait i got see ya. i can't do the dab it's been ages perfect, perfect.